I've got these brand new DVDs up here. I took one down. I bought them, but for some reason, my laptop does not like them. They've been hanging up there on the nail for probably six months. So I took one down. I'm going to show you what, what happens when you stick it in the microwave. I'm going to put the DVD in the microwave with the aluminum side up. and My microwave, microwave needs to be cleaned. I put some shrimp in there the other day, some fried shrimp, and they blew up all over the place. I cooked them too long. And you don't want to do that when you put a CD or a DVD in the microwave. Just a couple seconds is enough. Otherwise, it's going to stink. Alright, I'm not sure how well this is going to show up. I put it on for three seconds. I'm going to hit the start button. That was long enough, long enough for you to see the reaction. All right, it's ended. I'm gonna open the microwave and show you the results. Look at that. Is that cool or what? It's like lightning went through the DVD and just fried it. <laughs> you wanna destroy a DVD or a CD, that's the way to do it. Do that first and then burn it. Because what that is in there is, it's actually aluminum. Really, really thin layer of aluminum that they put inside of a CD and a DVD. And that's where you're burning your information on is that aluminum. And that's like putting aluminum foil in a microwave. Super micro thin aluminum foil. But these spaces in between probably still contain information. So if you really wanted to destroy it, you put it in the microwave for three seconds, then you throw it in the fire. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Just wanted to show you putting a DVD in the microwave.